up? My name is Sonali. Welcome to Vlogmas Day 20 freaking five. We made it. Merry Christmas. Got a little background scenery going on. We're about to have breakfast and get this day started. We got a yummy fruit tart, some sourdough bread. This stuff was so good. I was like craving it this morning. Open the champagne. I'm gonna spray you're it like, over you. You're like literally facing it like mm -hmm. at me. Ready? One, two, three. Damn, break it down. Twist. Pull, pull, twist. twist. Hmm. <laughs> Where are you pointing at? There. There. Ready? One, two, three. <gasps> Ooh. <shit. laughs> that went flying. <laughs> Yay. Okay, we're going to use this lemonade today. Because we we're all out of damn cranberry juice at the grocery store, but that's okay because this is better than this. I think so. I'm gonna shake it. Pick your poison. Strongest. Oh wait, yeah, strongest. So Nisha found this recipe from Half Big Harvest for these like brie pastry cranberry things. So we're starting with the cranberries. I don't have any orange juice, so I'm just squeezing my own. I thought you had orange juice in the freezer. Oh, orange juice in the freezer. That's fine. This works, okay. Mommy. Okay. Easy's perfectly fine. guys watched my vlog yesterday welcome back to Snolly's cooking show we're gonna try out a half-baked harvest recipe today we're gonna do brie cranberry puffed pastries and so we already made the cranberry as you saw it really was mind-blowing I was I just didn't understand how a hard little fruit thingy mabob just turns into jelly things um, oh yeah this is fresh cranberries and it turned into jelly it was crazy we got pre-made puff pastry sheets and then we have these little brie cheese bites that I um, already cut up. And then we have some champagne we're sipping on. So let's get started. In a rollometer, go, go, get in the sun so it can be warm. It's actually really cold. I feel like all the other Christmases See, have never nice been this cold. Yeah. Sophie, where are you going? Uh, Sophie. The closest we'll get to snow. Sophie. It's icicle. Oh, wait, there it is. No, we had snow yesterday. You just didn't wake up in time. It was like midnight or something. No, it wasn't. It was like... <laughs> okay, go over there. Okay. Gotta pose it. It's so cold. What did you make? Um, bread rice. Mm -hmm. That is a typical Kerala rice. Mm -hmm. Shrimp curry, spinach, eggplant, and okra. Yum. Thank you. I'm back at my dad's house for the night. I'm gonna eat dinner here and Ryan's gonna come over too. Um, but today, no, tomorrow is my last day here in Georgia. I'm actually flying out on the 27th, going back to Austin. So freaking excited, but I have a lot to pack and just like get my shit together before, you know, 
leaving, obviously. Um, I have to figure out what I'm gonna do with all my stuff. I think Ryan's gonna buy a car and then he'll like drive it back with all my stuff in it, but I don't know how long I'm gonna be without all my stuff. So I need to like decide what's more important to take back when I'm like actually gonna go back and you know, the stuff comes with me versus what's not as important that can wait. So that'll be very hard because <laughs> I feel like I'm the type of person that always is like, oh my God, this is so important. It has to come back with me because I'm gonna need it like tomorrow and then never touch it. Um, but I have all my stuff where my mom's gonna just like unpack really quick. Ryan's gonna be on his way over soon and then I'm just gonna like put on a dress or something. Uh, and yeah, just freshen up. I curled my hair today with like a wand from like Walmart or something I found in my mom's house. And I actually like the curls. My hair is getting longer. Somebody on my last vlog, they're like, wait, did your hair just get long out of nowhere? I'm like, I'm telling you guys, my hair grows so freaking fast because I was looking at pictures and I'm pretty sure it was like here. Well, as you can see, my like highlights have grown out. So like, I guess it's just grown that much, but it just does seem a lot longer, which I'm so happy about because, you know, like I said, I really did miss my long hair. Ready. Ready. Did you oh. pick your card? Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, go. Bubble black. An ass white. <laughs> <laughs> it is the day after Christmas, and of course, I really didn't think I would be vlogging today because, you know, it's the end of Vlogmas. Well, yesterday was the end of Vlogmas. I didn't really end up the vlog, and when I got to my dad's house, we literally just played Pictionary the whole night. Um, I got a few clips, but nothing crazy happened, so I ended up not really vlogging. The good news is, is that me and Ryan actually won Pictionary. I was like so hyped. <laughs> I definitely would say I'm not a big game night person, but once I get into the flow, it's always so fun because I'm pretty competitive. I kind of wanted to just like close out Vlogmas as a whole. And sorry if you can see the mess of my room in the back. Um, I'm packing because I'm gonna go back to Austin tomorrow, which is so exciting because I'm just ready to kind of just get back into my routine of things and be in my own place. I mean, I'm so grateful that, you know, both my parents live in Georgia still and that I had beautiful places to stay, but I just miss my apartment so much and I miss Austin and I'm just really excited to, you know, like I said, get back into my routine, kind of tidy up in my place, uh, clean up, and then my friends are actually gonna come and visit me. So I'm freaking stoked about that. A couple of vlogs ago, I did a giveaway for a stately box and I said I would announce the giveaway winner on Christmas. So sorry if that didn't happen. I put all the names in a random name generator and Sumitha is the winner. So Sumitha, if you're watching this, I probably have already Instagram DM'd you. We'll get you that stately box for your brother, boyfriend or dad or whoever you wanna give it to. Um, and then I also wanna just say like a big thank you to everyone who not not only watched but commented on any of my vlogs this vlogmas because it definitely was a lot of work and I mean I'm so proud of myself that I you know had a goal to not skip a day and I did that and I'm so freaking excited that I finally did vlogmas like all the way through it's definitely a challenge it's meant to be a challenge and I'm freaking excited that I did it for 25 days whenever I post my videos and I see someone comments on my videos it makes me so freaking happy it just means so much that you're like really just taking the time to like comment on my video so if you've ever commented on my video just know that like that is so appreciated and all these people that do YouTube whether it's a job or a hobby it's a creative outlet for me but also a lot of time does go into all of this stuff so it just makes me feel really really special that you guys are appreciating the content as well I mean I am doing it for myself but also I have viewers out there and I want to make content for you guys too so I just wanted to say that I love and appreciate the community that this channel has given me and if you guys aren't already following me on Instagram I'll definitely be posting more over there these next couple of days because I think I'm gonna take like a little bit of a break from vlogging um, we'll see we'll see if I'm in the mood when I get back to Austin. So feel free to follow me on Instagram. It's so underscore gnarly without the G. And I will see y'all in my next video. Bye.